In a few minutes, my brothers and sisters, we will witness the exchange of love between Jimmy and Ashley. The love they are about to declare before all of us is no ordinary love. In fact, it's the most special kind of love there is. A sacred type of love. Certain spiritual writers call it unconditional love. And when you say unconditional love, the emphasis is not even on the word love. The emphasis and the focus is on the word unconditional. Ashley and Jimmy, you will be promising to one another that from this day on, you will love each other unconditionally. And what does unconditional loving mean? It's the strongest commitment you can make. Unconditional loving, someone simply says it means this, yes, I will love you always, no matter what. Yes, I will love you always, even if. Yes, I will love you always, whatever happens. Whatever happens to me, I will love you. Whatever, ha whatever happens to you, I will love you. Whatever happens tomorrow, I will love you. Father, in the name of Jesus, we come to you today to first say thank you. Thank you for allowing us to be a part of this day that you have made. Lord, we invite you to be a part of this wedding. We invite you to be a part of the pre-wedding festivities. Lord God, we thank you in advance for a healthy marriage for Ashley and I. And I pray that everyone in this circle gets to experience true love. Help us look at our significant others with agape love. And Lord, we believe that today will be a good day. In Jesus' name we pray. Amen. Ashley, we're about to get married. It's January 30th, uh, 2021. And I love you. I know you dreamed of this day your whole life. I've dreamed of this day my whole life also. And it's finally here for us. I thank you for being everything that I've always needed, for completing me and truly being who you are. I thank you because you are someone that has never judged me. You love me and I can be my authentic self around you. I thank you because you're my everything. And honestly, right now, I'm gonna be honest, I'm a little nervous. I didn't think I was gonna be nervous before the wedding. 
and now it's finally hit me. I think we're about two hours out, and I can't wait to do forever with you. I know you're probably looking gorgeous right now. The entire time I was getting my tux and preparing to walk down the aisle, I was thinking about what you are thinking about in this moment. I know in this moment you're thinking about life together. I know in this moment you're thinking about starting our own family together. I know in this moment you're hoping everything is going to be okay on your wedding day, but it's all going to turn out fine. I love you. I love you more than words can describe. Asher Rose Franklin. Well, hello, Jimmy. We finally made it to our big day. I just want to let you know as we prepare to get married that I love you. I'm so thankful that God heard every single prayer I prayed for in a husband. I thank you for your patience, your love, your compassion towards me, allowing me to heal in your presence and just loving me unconditionally. I thank you for showing up daily to be the best for us. I love you. And as we prepare to walk down the aisle, I give God all the glory for showing how much he favored me by blessing me with you as my future husband. Love you. For so long, I thought God had forgotten about me. I constantly prayed for a man who loved God. More than me. Because I knew if he loved God wholeheartedly, he would be a man led by God, not emotions. A man who knew the power of prayer and one that could cover me. A man of great integrity, a man that would love me with grace, compassion, patience, gentleness, humbleness. As we prepare to become one, I'm so full of overflowing beautiful emotions to know that God didn't forget about me and he didn't forget about you either. He came and handcrafted a man of God just for me. When I think of you, I'm constantly reminded just how much God favors me. On today, I make this vow, not only to you, but unto God. I vow to love you uniquely in a way that makes you feel favored by God daily. I vow to love you through hard times. I vow to always be a listening ear to help you navigate through this journey called life. I vow to love your family as my own and to be your helpmeet to be a wife that brings peace to the home, to laugh with you, to hold you in life's moments of difficulties, to be committed to you until the end of time. Jimmy Jamel Strong, I love you and thank you for loving me each day unconditionally, helping me heal from past hurts and showing up daily to be the best you can be for us. The end. Ashley Rose, on our first date as we sat and ate hot wings, something told me that you would be my wife. And since that day, over the years, you have shown me and helped me to understand what it feels like to be in love. I've grown to love everything about you including your corny jokes, your endless energy, and I've even grown to love and appreciate the fact that you are the most talkative person I have ever met. <laughs> it was your beauty that attracted me to you, 
but I fell in love because of your encouraging words, kind spirit, and uncompromising love for the Lord. I thank God because it seems like he knew what I needed when he made you. You are my help sent from God. You compliment me in every way. As I look back at how far God has brought us from, I look forward to where we are headed because through it all, God has given us victory over every test we have had together. I promise from this day forward to remember that laughter is one of God's greatest creations and I will never stop laughing with you. I promise to love you unconditionally and be patient as we figure out life together. I promise to provide and to be attentive to all of your needs. I promise to protect you and make you feel safe whenever I am around. I promise to push you forward in an effort to help you become the best version of yourself. And most importantly, I promise to always keep Christ as the center of our union. I don't know why y'all even got me here. <laughs> and I make this announcement now that in so much as in the presence of Almighty God that this man and this woman have willfully committed by oath to be man and wife and have sealed it by the exchanging of marital rings that I do now in the name of God the Father, Son, and the Holy Ghost and the state of South Carolina in Atlanta do now pronounce them husband and wife and what God has joined together let no man put us under and now brother Jimmy Strong you may do something you've never done before in your life you may now kiss your wife I present to the world Mr. and Mrs. Ashley and Jimmy Strong. Taking my sweet
Celebrate with us, so we just thank you all. We just really can't put it to words. We just love you all. We love Appreciate you. Love you. Love you. And we want to give a special shout out to all of our vendors and our wedding planner Joanna with Vela Rose Events. Oh, 